Weasel News. Now for the news brought to you by YourMexicanDoctor.com. All the pharmaceuticals you need. The reign of crack is coming to an end. Bohan-based drug dealer Elizabeth Torres won't be pushing crack rocks on a corner near you anytime soon. That's because Judge McBurrows handed down a 300-year prison sentence as she was convicted of 30 counts of cocaine distribution at 10 years a count. The Center for American Justice, Bribery, and Freedom issued a stunning report that lower student aptitude tests in elementary schools indicate fans of professional wrestling are still breeding. Despite knowing that it's fake, wrestling fans pay more attention to these soap operas for men than contributing to society. The group advocates mass sterilization at all wrestling events, which they indicate will raise test scores in as little as 10 years. And more importantly, in celebrity news, the big story of the day, fans of Filthy Rich Eras, Chloe Parker, are outraged at the news that her backing dancer and now fiancé has countered her prenup with a request for a $3 million dowry. Parker's agent has issued a statement saying that this is just paperwork and the couple are still very much in love. This is Weasel News. This is Weasel News.